Especially when planning for a baby, it makes sense to take a closer look at the cervical mucus as it reveals when we are in our most fertile phase and chances for a baby are at an optimum. In the overlying gland, cervical mucus of varying quality is produced, which gives information about whether we are in our fertile phase or not. You simply take some mucus with the index finger and check, as shown in the graphs, if the mucus is rather creamy, watery or stretchy. Sometimes the cervical mucus is thick and impermeable and thus closes the cervix to protect us from germs. It also works to prevent sperm from entering, as the body is hormonally not yet ready for the ovum to get fertilized. On the other hand, when our body is ready for conception, the cervical mucus is more fluid and even sugary in order to protect, filter, nourish and direct sperm. Glands at the base of the cervix usually produce this type of mucus after menstruation and after ovulation has taken place. Once menstrual bleeding stops, the cervix closes and a mucus that is impenetrable for sperm is blocking the way into the uterus. Male sperm cannot withstand this exitic vaginal environment and thus survival is a maximum of 3 hours. Now the glands located a little higher up in the cervix produce sticky lumpy mucus that gradually becomes more fluid and creamy. The vagina becomes more moist and now you can see more traces of the cervical mucus at the vaginal opening. These are the first signs that you're entering your fertile phase. It is still difficult for the sperm to move rapidly, but they can now protect themselves from the acidic vaginal environment, even if only for a short time. A few days before ovulation, estrogen mucus is produced, which is stretchy and fluid, often even spinnable, very similar to raw egg white or even more watery. This mucus protects, filters, nourishes and transports the sperm and the sugar contained in it luring them into the cervix. The sperm can survive here for 3 to a maximum of 5 days. This is now the best time to be intimate if you're planning for a baby. Cervical mucus is an important marker of female fertility for women who have been explicitly trained in observation. The nature of cervical mucus can be registered in the notes section in Daisy's app, providing an additional tool for those planning pregnancy. Even women who are trained are often unsure about the correct interpretation of their cervical mucus. The DAISY algorithm does not allow for these personal notes to be included in the fertility calculations. DAISY is a device that is designed to be used independently, without the need for additional education. 